for the interpod range, which comes in three different arch heights, has a plantar fascial groove, is wedged in the rear foot, part of that decision making process you know, is based on the supination resistance test. If that was high, we want to go for the higher arch height. If that test was low, we can lose the, use the lower arch height. They need to be fitted for the length with the end of the device coming to just behind the metatarsal heads. Once we've decided on the most appropriate orthoses prescription, we obviously need to check to make sure the orthoses are going to be able to fit in the footwear. We've already checked the footwear as part of our initial history um, and wear patterns, but now we need to look further with the orthoses prescription. When it comes to um, a sporting, athletic or running shoe, you know, we can get away with these full length devices that it can give some four foot cushioning as well and they will fit in there with, without much trouble. Again, three quarter length will fit in quite well and again we can use the flex device in a sporting type shoe. When it comes to a, a fairly um, roomy casual shoe, the three quarter, the full length can be used with some caution because it may be too thick in the forefoot and then we're going to stick to the, need probably need to stick to the three quarter length, the flex or the softer device. When it comes to the much smarter um, dress shoe, we're not going to be able to use the three quarter, the full length, the three quarter may be even a bit too bulky for those. We certainly can use the flex device and we may need to resort to you know, a cut down device to, to be able to fit it into the shoe. So once we've made the decision as to you know, the most appropriate orthoses to use and the fit to the footwear, we need to consider you know, whether the flex or the soft design is the most appropriate. The, the flex design is much more durable, it's made from a polypropylene type material and certainly will last several years. It comes in three arch heights, the height of the arch should be determined by the supination resistance testing and it does have a self-adhesive cover. It's certainly suitable for all feet, it is slim and easy to fit to all shoes. The soft design is made out of a shock absorbing material and comes in three shapes, the three quarter length, the full length and the more cut down version for dress shoes. It's made out of polyurethane and is not as durable as the flex design but will certainly last a substantial amount of time.